I'm going to be doing some spring cleaning today and I'm going to start with this cabinet, but I'm a little embarrassed to show it to you. Hi, I'm Randy and I help you make big memories in small campers because weekends are just too short. <laughs> Look how dirty this is. <gasps> Yuck. I'm not sure where this gunk comes from, but it's here. And are you like me and keep adding things to your storage spaces and after a while you forget what you put in these areas? This drives me crazy. This has become a dirty, unorganized mess and I need to fix it. It's been about a year since I added the Gorilla Grip shelf liner to my RV cabinet shelves. While they are filthy dirty, I'm so glad I used them. Otherwise, this grime would be on my shelves and that would be worse. Because here's the thing, this liner created a barrier protecting my cabinets from damage caused by these nasty stains. I also use the Gorilla Grip shelf liners in my cubbies because it helps keep things in place and from slipping around, which is especially important when your RV is driving down the road. Okay, let's do it. Let's get this RV cabinet cleaned and organized. That's a lot of stuff. Not all of the liners are as filthy as this one, but they all are pretty dirty. Oh, I'm starting to feel better already. Next, we need to wipe down the shelves. And for this, I'm gonna use my secret cleaning solution. Stay tuned for next week's video when I reveal my magic cleaner because it will make cleaning your RV a breeze. The cabinets were still pretty dirty. I'm so glad that the Gorilla Pads were there to catch the majority of the sticky, icky gunk. These liners are washable, so let's see if we can get them cleaned. That's dirty. Ugh. Ten minutes later. The dirt came off, but I couldn't get the stains removed, so I'm glad I had a backup. I've opted for black this time because the white stains so badly. Are you as excited as I am, Princey, to see how clean and organized we can get this cabinet? The first step to installing the new Gorilla Grip shelf liner is to measure the space where it will be placed. Next, we'll use these measurements to cut the liner so that it fits on the shelf. first piece is cut and ready to be put in the cabinet. <laughs> Yay, I'm so happy. It's looking so nice. It's time to go through things, see what needs to be tossed and what I've got and get organized. 